So asked a question on uh, why is reincarnation not so known in the West? Well, I'd say that um, uh, I mean the primary teachers of the West were um, uh, having the religions, um, i.e. Judaism, uh, Islam, Christianity, of the uh, of the one God in literature, or that being the prevailing background into which spiritual teachers of enlightened nature came in. So it was more practical, I'd say, like with Jesus, more practical to speak to the masses and avoid the topic of reincarnation, uh, because otherwise you're going to get it's going to be very difficult for that the population at that time to digest reincarnation. Even though if, with muscle testing, if you check in the Bible, I can't remember the exact what is said, but it's something like Jesus says, um, and Isaiah has come back as Paul or something like that. And if you check that with muscle testing, that comes up, he's referring to reincarnation. I suspect my guess is with his um, disciples, he did go into more esoteric, deeper truths for those who are having uh, larger spiritual awakenings, but to the masses, uh, he, he kept uh, reincarnation out of it. In the East, where the religions, you had the Vedas, the ancient Indians, uh, sages who talked about reincarnation and the infinite presence. So in that history of, of the Eastern cultures, like in Hinduism and Buddhism, um, reincarnation was already accepted by the masses. So enlightened teachers could very easily uh, describe the laws of karma and reincarnation and how to get free of that uh, through enlightenment. Um, so that's well known. But in, in the West, you can try past life uh, regression hypnotherapy uh, as a way to get uh, access your past lives and get proof that they uh, do exist. And you can try muscle testing and that will also give you um, uh, information about your past life. But also you, if you read enough on the subject, you'll be able to intuit what your past lives are by, you know, do you like, um, for example, I like, I particularly like, was attracted to the German culture or, and people who have past, uh, you know, have past life recall or past life hypnotherapy will find that, oh yeah, that makes sense when I see the past lives, why my interests are like this in this life. It is useful, um, past lives, because you can do anti-karma prayers and you are able to release um, karmic baggage by realizing, oh yes, this person in this life is really horrible to me, but I can see in the past life, I was really horrible to them. And so it's easier then to let go of the resentment and the, and the baggage you're holding around people once you know that from past lives. Okay. Uh, 